Hey, hello, welcome to your fourth C++ tutorial. In the last tutorial, we learned about variables and data types. Now, in this tutorial, we're going to learn about variable declarations and variable definitions. So, first of all, let's go and let's create a variable. Uh, let's create an integer variable named var. Now, I have created a variable named var, which is of type an integer. But it doesn't have any value inside it. Okay, I have just declared the variable and I've told the compiler just I have reserved the uh, reserved a portion of the computer's memory and I'm gonna put some value inside it. But I haven't yet put some value inside that. So this thing just declaring the variable it's called variable declaration. And when later on I just put a value inside it like this. I can put 5 inside it or 10 inside it. Let's put 10 inside it. Now in this statement, I have told compiler that I am putting 10 inside this variable. Okay. Or I am putting 10 inside the memory that is represented by this variable. Okay. So this is called variable definition because we are defining the value of the variable. Okay. So one more time. Here we are declaring the variable, just telling the compiler that we have a variable created. So this is the declaration of the variable. And here we are just uh, giving it a value, so it is called the definition of the variable. Now we can combine the both of the steps in a single line. Okay, suppose we create a new variable called int uh, v and we put a value inside it for 5. So as you guys can see, here we have combined variable declaration and variable definition at the same line okay so here we have variable declaration and the definition at the same line so we can also do that and it is more i mean more preferred in most of the times and we can also do something else we can uh, when we have same data type same vari variables of same data type we can put all of those in a single line as an example suppose i'm going to create a variable int a equals 5 then I'm going to create uh, int v equals 10. But instead of writing all those in separate lines, we can write it in a same line like int a equals 5, v equals 10, and c equals 13. Now what it does is our computer creates, uh, the compiler creates variables a with uh, data type integer, b with data type integer, c with data type integer, and assigns these values to those, to those variables. So as you can see, only when we have all the variables of same data type, we can do this thing. Let's run it. And uh, it's taking much time. And it's here it is. So whenever we have a lot of variables with same data types, we can declare and define declare and define those in a same line. We can also do it for any kind of variable. Suppose we have float variables. We can also do it for this 5.5, um, c equals 6.5.6, 5.6, or whatever. So this was all about variable declarations and definitions. Uh, this is very important concepts. So I hope all of your concepts have become clear. If you have any questions, please write those in comments. I hope it helped. Please subscribe to my channel, like, and share. Thank you very much.